Hey there everybody, how's it going? It's all the Angry Nerd again today. And uh, we're going to be playing some Happy Dungeons. Uh, I remember seeing this a little while ago on the, uh, I forget what their names are, like the, the Twitter of the people that made Happy Wars. And uh, yeah, let me just pull that off for a minute. Uh, yeah, uh, I remember seeing that on their Twitter that they were going to be doing like a more single player oriented game. Where, uh, like, you can just get in and do it, because Happy Wars was, uh... If you never played it, it's a game where pretty much, like, you always are in constant PvP, just constantly. There And there, there were, like, other, uh... Sorry, I just woke up. There, there's some other, um, uh, modes on there where it's, like, you can fight bots or whatever, but it wasn't really as fun, and everybody honestly wanted, like... A better single player to it so they made uh, happy dungeons it's pretty much the same and um, yeah no it, it looked good and it's on game preview so I wanted to try it out so okay let me see so difficulty human and you can search for games online I'm probably gonna do that so you can do epilogue or chapter one Alright, cool. But yeah, uh, I was always a big fan of Happy Wars and everything else. <clears throat> so, um, you know, it was, uh, it was good. I, I, I really liked the classic Happy Wars, and it's nice that they're actually doing, like, a dungeon-styled game with it. That's why it's called, like, Happy Dungeons, because it's a it's a very dungeon-oriented game. And for me, obviously, the guy who I'm going to be playing is the Sword and Board character, or Lance and Board. Because, uh, since I played the old Happy Wars, um, <clears throat> I was able to, like, get some stuff. So it's like, there, there's me right there. I got a cool, like, samurai outfit, kung fu master shield, and all this other shit, and I just put on the elf cap because I didn't like the main head piece they gave you. And, uh, I got an elite controller because I, I, I got an elite controller lately, and I, or before, and maybe they, like, read my thing saying that I got one. <clears throat> wait till we get, wait. Now we're just gonna, there we go, ready. Yeah, this game is actually, like, really, really fun. Uh, like, before I played it. Like, uh, for this game, let me see. You have lots of sessions because the community, ah, uh, okay, whatever, you know what, I'm just probably gonna make my own then. Wait, 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 go back. <clears throat> Difficulty human. Let me create a game. Let me do that. Search for the princess. And, yeah, I'll probably just start it. I don't care. We don't need, like, a giant group of people. But, yeah, I, I always loved the these games because I love the little chibi characters that would fight against each other. Not saying that, like, Happy Wars is bad. It's just... Oh, look at that. <laughs> Yeah, like, I, I just love, like, the little chibi dudes on here. Oh, wait, I got an idea. Here comes some memory crap. Oh, nice. <laughs> My head hurts while I'm tied up. Yeah, I love that. But, uh, yeah, no, like, this game's, like, really, really fun. Like, I, I like the prologue, because pretty much, like, just you going in. And, uh, like, just killing, like, NPCs, because, uh... It, it was always kind of a struggle to get into playing a game of Happy Wars, like, with connection. And, uh... Honestly, it didn't really feel the same playing against bots, because, like, I don't think you can even, like... I, didn't, I don't even think that you could even upgrade their, uh like, thing, like, compared to, like, Call of Duty and other games where you actually can. So, it, it's nice that they were like, hey, we're gonna do, like, a dungeon-styled game mode. 
and uh, the bottom D-pad is your usables, you got your health on the top, then you got your A, B, X, Y that does attacks. Oh, okay. And I love my dude, my dude looks great. Like, I just gave him red hair just to match his outfit. And then I saw, like, the Zelda, like, looking elf cap, so I was like, alright, here we go. Let me see. Oh yeah, I forgot, like, they're still, like, teaching you how to play the game, but yeah, it's, it's really good, I like it. I wouldn't mind actually playing it with some friends of mine, like, over Skype or whatever, and, uh, you know, at least trying it out. But, uh, yeah, it, it's good. I like it. Oh yeah, I still got the classic rock throw. Oh, whoops, okay. Oh, and I forgot, those are my dudes. Yeah, Happy Wars was always, like, a really fun game, like, when it first came out. That's why I just like that this is just something, like, a bit different. Like, it's pretty much just Happy Wars, but at, like, a single, like, what do you call it, level. Like, at, at more of a just, like, single-player level where you're not constantly, like, forced to just be online. That or fight against, like, bots. Even though, like, technically, it's like, yeah, you're still fighting against bots on here, but... I don't know, I, I, I find a little bit more of an enjoyment out of it, I guess, because, uh... Happy Wars' story was just, like, very tiny, like, mission-based shit that I've never did. That I always just like dungeon crawler games. Like, that. that's always been my favorite type of game. Like, how D&D is always like that. And all you really need to do, like, if you ever played the other original Happy Wars, is, like, if you're a shield character, like, RT or whatever game that you're on, is, uh, your, is your block. You got your, uh, LT to dash... And you, X is pretty much the only button that you're really going to need. And how you use stuff is also with the dodge button. Then I like all this cool stuff I got too. Like I got, like, I don't have max health. But I'm pretty good. That and the weapon that I have is really good too. It does like, I don't think like a thousand damage, but it does a lot. Now, I just wanted to try this game out because I was like, man, you know, Happy Wars is really fun. Like, I love going online with my buddies and playing that. Because, <laughs> like, just, just seeing a whole army of, like, chibi dudes just hitting each other over and over again is hilarious. And this is just nice because it's more of, like, a solo experience. Or it can be multi because, you know, you can have a team of people. But, yeah, no, it's, uh... Oh, yeah. oh, you have a combo meter, too. That's cool, too. Oh, look at that. Chest, chest thing. Give me a second. I think somebody just texted me. Oh, wait. That's health. All right. <laughs> But yeah, no, it's uh, it's real fun. Like I, I, I like this game. I still think it's kind of lame because like I'm not, uh, I didn't spend a lot of money on the other Happy Wars thing, but uh, <sighs> uh, like I, I got most of like the customizable shit and whatever. So it's, it's kind of a disappointment that I don't have that shit brought over. But it's like you know, make more money, or it you gotta like withhold the cool looking stuff and it's like I could totally just go on there and buy because it it's like it's four dollars but like I, I spent like 50 bucks yesterday on like some other things that I'm gonna record and, and this thankfully was free because it's game preview but uh yeah, no, I like this. It's like you level up and you actually, like, instead of the original Happy Wars, it's like you feel like you actually are doing something. Because it's like your, your character keeps leveling up with you.
but yeah. No, I, I got a couple other games that I'm gonna record. I'm gonna be recording We Happy Few. Because, um, I, I, the, the reason why I took such a long break, too, from recording was, uh, we had people outside for, that were for Optic TV, like, this cable company thing, and they were, like, going around our building pretty much, like, uh, what do you call it, like, just, like, fixing it up and making sure that, you know, people can actually get it here, so, and most of the times, usually, when I record, it's in, like, the dead of morning, or, like, you know, before, like, or dusk, more or less. That's how it usually goes for my recording stuff. But, yeah. Uh, I, I, yeah, I can't wait to try We, uh, we Happy Few. Because, um, I remember seeing Uber Hacks or Nova, and, like, a couple, of, like, there's probably, like, more YouTubers out there that played it on, like, PC and whatever. Because, you know, you, you get a first, right, since you're on PC. So, uh, yeah, I saw them play it, and I was like, man, this game looks really interesting. Like, I like that, um, the whole premises of it is that you're a downer, and, like, I think now it's like you're trying to find your brother. Because, uh, I don't know, something happened. And then you get, like, super triggered after, like, looking at something with you and him in it. Then you get, like, the choice of, like, keep doing the drug or, you know, like, get off the drug and, like, try to find your brother. And it's just, um, it's a cool, like, little twist to, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, it, it, it it's, it's. It's a it's a cool twist to pretty much like what um oh, wait I got another text or let me see okay there we go but yeah no it it's a cool little twist and spin to pretty much like um that <sighs> uh, to like that genre. Because, like, the whole thing, it, it, like, everything's wrong because everybody's so goddamn happy. And it's funny that I'm playing a game called Happy Wars where everybody's pretty much happy. That's, that's actually fucking hilarious. But yeah, that's some, that's some good shit. Oh, look at that. What's that? I got something. Yeah, yeah, I'll advance in a fucking minute. You give me a second. With these dungeon games, you always gotta look. <laughs> Think I can't read and shit, dog? What's over here? Oh, these are just other people. Okay. Yeah, I saw some treasure chests and wanted to make sure I got... Oh, look a little rubber ducky in there. But yeah, no, it's, uh... <clears throat> but yeah, uh, for We Happy Few, it looks like a really good game. Like, I remember seeing, like, Nova play a bit of it. Like, him just, like, fucking around and doing stuff. And now, with the updated version of it, they actually, um... Like, what do you call it? They added, like, missions to it. Compared to what he played, where there wasn't any missions to it. Because it was, like, alpha out. Al like, it was, it was alpha build, obviously. And it still technically is alpha build, but I like that it's on Xbox and everything, because, like, I wouldn't have minded playing, uh, what do you call it, like, playing it on PC. Like, if, if I knew, for one, like, let's say, where to get it, and two, like, if, if my recording setup was better for PC. Because, like, I'm still trying to, uh, oh, look at that, they, they actually have bosses now. Oh, look at you. I didn't mean to do that, I forgot. The button commands are still the same. Here, let me throw this rock at you. This armor I have is pretty fucking cheap. I'm not taking, like, any damage. That's great. Oh, now I am. I didn't mean to click that again, sorry. We'll get fucking just slam-bammed on. Look at that. Slam-bam again. I'm kind of disappointed. I wish they had the Berserker class on here. Like how uh, the original Happy Wars did. 
Oh, there we go. I rocked him. Oh, I rocked him. Oh, fuck you. You're dead. Or knocked out. <laughs> oh, I just fucking just owned him super bad. That's awesome. Our destination's in the green cave. Alright, well, let me keep picking up money in here because uh, they, they make it a lot easier to get happy money on here because that was a big problem with Happy Wars. It's hard to get the cool shit because, um, like, you get a lot for winning and then you don't get anything for, like, losing. That That's how it kind of was. Like, you, you get, like, the bare minimum of, like, coins and shit. <laughs> Oh, you get a fame meter, too. Oh, look at that. You can select a new dun dungeon, the Cookie Thief Rescue Mission. And then I got an axe that I'm probably never gonna use. And then look at all this other stuff that I'm probably not gonna use. Fatal Wound, Defense Up, Honorable Wound. Alright, cool. That will go to the next dungeon, why not? I'm actually enjoying myself with this game. And I'll probably just start it on my own, because um, I don't feel like sitting here and waiting for people that just don't want to ready up. <laughs> but yeah, no, this, uh, this game's real fun, and it's really good. There we go, it's a little too hot for having a hat on right now, but... Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's a really good, like game where it's like you can just get on here and play you see there's something behind there because it, it that that shit looks like there's something should be behind there i'm right oh uh, no i'm i'm wrong okay i thought there could have been something behind there because <clears throat> i like finding little secrets in between that stuff but yeah there's nothing there Oh, it's a goblin. Oh, look at that. Yeah, you gotta punish the goblins super hard. I forgot that the, the rock stuns people, so that's, like, really good. So if somebody's just holding up a shield, it's good just to do that. And I forgot I can make myself go quicker by just rolling. Come on, you son of a bitch. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. That's like a can of Red Bull right there. Oh, I can't even get it if I wanted to. Because I'm like recharging my shit too quick. There, give me the can of Red Bull. There we go. That's great. I feel super cheap because it's like, man, this weapon does so much damage and my shielding does so much. Like it does a thousand. But the thing is, with this, I'm slow as shit. Like, even though it doesn't look like I am, like, even they're like, man, like, you, you're, you're super slow, so... Watch out for that shit. But yeah, no, uh, We Happy Few looks like a really good game, and I I hope when, like, the actual, like, when it comes out of alf Alpha and everything else, like, I hope it does really good, because it looks good. Oh, God, he kicked him in. What an asshole. Be like, that's somebody I just, I could have killed. Also, too, I haven't really used any of my health shit or anything else. I honestly should, because, you know... Like, I, at least I should show it off in the video, but it, it's just, honestly, it's like I don't want to waste it. You know, I guess one thing I do want to try is this. Oh, okay, so that's like, um, I just, I toss a spear and it just, it does a shit ton of damage. And I remember with the, like, other Happy Wars 2 was kind of like back when, when this game first came out, it was like pay to win. 
where it's like um in, in the other happy wars game pretty much like all you really needed to do was like b before they updated it was like buy this pack that gives you pretty much like everything good did I kill everything already? Holy Christ, I killed everything already. Oh, look at him. Look at the goblin leader. Look at his face. He's all cute and shit. Go, uh, go after him and say granny cookies. Alright, we're gonna go say granny cookies. <clears throat> but yeah, no, it's 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 real fun. And I'm happy that there is, like, a difficulty thing to this, too. Because I could totally see myself playing this a bit more, too. Because, like, it's so fun. And it's like, it, it's not as competitive, too, because, man, back in the day, niggas got super competitive on, uh, what do you call them, Happy Wars. And it's like, man, it's a kid's game. And it's, and it's great, like, just hearing people just get super, like, mad, because I, I remember meeting people on here that were, like, the dudes that spend all their, their money to level up their little chibi people. And it's really sad how hard that game died out. So it's like it would have been like a waste of money even putting anything on there. Because little to nobody plays Happy Wars even on this gen too. Like there, there's a very tiny community. That's why I think honestly they wanted to make dungeons. So you know it's like hey. We actually have missions now that aren't just like hey go run around and do whatever. And, and they have, like, somewhat of a story, too, compared to the other ones. Where the story was just, like, kind of basic and bland. Like, same with this, too. Like, it's on honestly, like, how I feel about this. It's, like, a, uh... It's just, it's just like, a good beat-em-up. You know what I mean? Just because it's, like, man, you're just, like, just going around beating dudes up, doing your stuff. Getting your little coins, beating up the bosses. Oh yeah, I pushed him into the fucking purple gear. Oh, look at that health bar, though. Don't you feel your cool and shit? I'd love to get his mask. Oh, come on now, and and it messed up on me. All right, I hope you guys enjoy. Subscribe to my friend today, and I'll see you guys in the next one.